In this lecture, I'm going to cover specific signals and guidance given by the MAGIC multi-moving average trading system. The first and most probably the most obvious trading signal is the extreme consolidation. That is when all the moving averages start condensing into one little area and the colors almost mesh together. It doesn't have to mesh together, but as long as there's an extreme consolidation, it is a sign that there will be a nice volatile breakout coming out of that consolidation. We call that consolidation a knot, and there are various ways of trading that knot. You can either straddle the knot, so in other words, put a buy above it and a sell below it, and ride the trend that develops from that particular knot. Some traders think they are clever enough to spot the potential breakout of that knot and they would then only place a one-sided pending order very close to their knot to catch any particular breakout. So that covers the knot. Then after the knot comes the waterfall. That is the phase where all the moving averages point in a particular direction and signify a very, very strong trend. This does not need to happen straight after a knot. It can happen after crossover activities. But when all the moving averages are pointing in the same direction, it is giving an almost obvious message that the market is trending very strongly. And you would be quite silly to try and trade against that trend. So the waterfall is our next signal or guidance formation. Then the next area is the consolidation, which often happens after the waterfall has lost its strength and the market then consolidates at the new levels. A signal of consolidation is when the fast moving average just flattens out as it goes into the other moving averages, then you can expect a consolidation to occur. We also do have the reversal signal. That is when there's a, a beautiful waterfall type of formation that happens and then the fast moving averages has a very sharp reversal and cuts into the other moving averages at a very sharp angle. And that, when that happens, the chances of a reversal are a lot stronger. So watch out for the reversal signal. Then there is the exit. One of the nice things about this particular trading technique is that it does provide exit signals. So when you are in a waterfall and you are trading in the direction of the trend and you're in a transaction, your exit will occur when the fast moving average crosses over the next moving average. On a balance of probabilities, that is the most optimum exit you can make out of a waterfall formation. We then have the continuation trade. Now the continuation trade is when the fast moving average cuts back and cuts over the next moving average, but then spends a very short time and then continues pointing in the, the, the direction of the overall trend. That is a strong continuation signal and obviously you would then trade in the direction of the trend. Often students ask, when there is a knot, how do I know what the likely direction of the breakout will be? Now the best guidance I can give in this area is in this example that we're looking at right now. Always look where the fast moving average has come from and is going to. If it's cutting into the knot from the bottom, it is likely that it's going to shoot out the top and therefore the likely outcome of that consolidation will be a buy. As you may know, the market also goes through messy phases where nothing much is happening and it is best to stay out of the market. The magic moving average will give you hints of this where the moving averages are in general quite flat and there are just zigzag movements over the flat movement. 
it would be better to stay away from those type of movements. In future lectures, we'll be looking at how you can view the whole market using the magic multiple moving average approach. And by doing this, you can be selective and choose the best setups that the market presents and also stay away from the messy setups. These signals might become clearer as we go through more trading examples.